Hey everyone, this is Sugandha and you're watching Ready for Rises English and I hope so you all are well and you all are waiting for my sessions. Today we will be discussing something interesting and yes that is what is layoff. What is layoff? So make sure to subscribe this channel if you're watching me for the very first time and do hit that cute notification bell icon so that you could get updates later on as well, right? So let's get started with it and uh, what is layoff? Layoff is basically a temporary or permanent uh, termination of employment uh, for a group of employees by an organization. And that could be usually due to the factors beyond the employee's control. Yes, layoff is temporary or permanent termination of employees. And that is definitely beyond the employee's control. So this is basically a business decision uh, which is made by the employer. And often in response to various situations such as uh, they are uh, having economic downturns or uh, some financial constraints, restructuring, technological changes or uh, we can say business reorganization. There can be multiple reasons for this layoff and uh, obviously employer decides this on the basis of uh, a lot of uh, planning means this layoff is being done by a proper process uh, wherein proper information is being provided to the employees. So let's discuss some key points about layoffs. Uh, that so is first is temporary or permanent. Now see, layoffs can be temporary or permanent. Temporary layoffs involve a short term suspension of employment means for uh, some duration of time like employees may be called back to work when conditions improve like uh, we are struggling with few things for a month, for two months, for three months. So there is a temporary termination whereas permanent layoffs involve uh, termination of employment for indefinite period. We are not aware that we will be able to recover from this or not. So we are doing a permanent layoff. Like situations are worse and will worsen in the future. So we are doing permanent layoff. Next is no fault of employees. Obviously, there is no fault of employees. Layoffs are typically not due to the performance or you can say behavior of the affected employees. It is uh, not considered a disciplinary action, but yes, rather a response to external circumstances affecting the company. It could be external factors or yes, internal factors. There is a disorganization, business, uh, you know, business uh, downturns are there, financial constraints are there. So obviously, all these things are uh, not uh, against the employees. Uh, means so uh, uh, this is not a disciplinary action uh, which needs to be taken against the employees right next is workforce reduction now what is this workforce reduction obviously layoffs involve a reduction in the size of the workforce we need to reduce the size of the workforce maybe due to financial constraint or uh, due to restructuring definitely with the aim of uh, cutting cost and yes aligning the organization's resources with current business needs now current business needs are uh, smaller as compared to as it was in the past so we need to cut the cost we need to organize the resources again we need to align the resources with the organization's today's need right business today's needs so we need to reduce the workforce for that next is severance packages now what is this depending on local labor laws and you can say company policies employees affected by layoffs may be ordered packages which may include like financial compensation or you can say extended uh, benefits or outplacement services to support the transition to new employment and that could be any means uh, there could be any kind of packages there could be any kind of extensions there could be any kind of help provided to the employees next is legal requirements now see in some jurisdictions there are uh, some legal requirements for the companies to provide advance notice of layoffs to employees and labor authorities so we need to adhere with the legal requirements we can't uh, uh, stand uh, one day or we can't uh, you know wake up one day and say that yes uh, these many employees are fired and there is no legal procedure obviously many times it happens that we got one mail but yes there is a back story to it all the planning has been uh, done since months uh, it's not a uh, you can say a night decision okay it seems to people that uh, it's one night decision but uh, no uh, a lot of planning a lot of months planning has been there to take such a big decision fine next is employee morale now layoffs can have a significant impact on employee morale and the overall work environment Employee may feel that why I have been layoffed means why I have been removed, why other people are not removed. It could be that uh, 10,000 people are working and only 1,500 people are removed and rest 8,500 are working. So the, these people can think that why I have been removed. 
right so this could be there and it can yes create uncertainty and anxiety among remaining employees also all those employees who are remaining they may think that yes uh, within one or two months we will be out <laughs> okay and yes that will affect their productivity and yes loyalty to the company as well because uh, it could be there that employees uh, start uh, switching the jobs or they will start applying for the jobs they won't be able to work with the same productivity with the same uh, satisfaction in the organization they might be thinking that yes we will be removed one day like uh, our other colleagues and uh, what will be our status then let's find new jobs but it's not the case mm, all uh, it's not a case like all the employees will be removed in layoff uh, it can be a temporary and yes it can be a permanent situation <laughs> it can be a temporary situation uh, we can never say that yes it will remain forever okay so this is layoff and uh, basically layoffs are uh, considered a last resort for companies facing financial difficulties or you can say uh, significant changes in their business environment the companies who are looking to make significant changes in their business environment and yes employers usually explore other cost saving measures or restructuring options before resorting to layoffs as i told that people feel that yes this is a one night uh, decision no it's not uh, employers search for different alternatives before doing this because they know that employees are human beings they will react to it they will have issues and how can we remove people like this so but if they are in the crisis financial crisis it's better not to hang these people and not to you know uh, keep their salaries for months just to uh, to make them uh, sat feel satisfied at this job and uh, if you are means if you are not able to pay them uh, and uh, you are uh, not able to pay for two months three months four months and you are not able to say no to them then uh, this will be of no use because obviously uh, half of the employee will uh, leave organizations in between because obviously they would be having monthly bills monthly expenses so they can't afford uh, not uh, having salary for two months or three months and uh, so it's better to take decision properly it's better to take decision as soon as possible it's better to uh, lay off these employees rather than hanging them okay if you feel that yes there is a financial constraint and things won't improve then yes it's better to lay off these employees but yes before implementing layoffs uh, then uh, the, you must uh, see the sensitivity and you must uh, follow the compliances legal requirements and yes ethical guidelines to minimize uh, actually minimize the negative impact on employees and the organization as a whole so this is a big decision it uh, needs proper planning and uh, then it should be done right so i hope so this is helpful and uh, if you want to see any other sessions related to this if you want to see the type of layoffs and the, any kind of processes if you want to know about it then please do let me know in the comment section and if it's helpful please do let me know So till next video all the very best to stay happy stay safe thanks for watching bye bye